Hey guys, what's going on? My name's Collins here, and welcome to another video. So today, what I have for you guys is a very, very special video. Um, after months of trying, about three months to be exact, 22 hours of in-game time, and a lot of blood, sweat, and tears, I have finally achieved the Moab in Modern Warfare 3 for the Wii. And I know a lot of you are thinking, Colin, Moabs are easy, you suck, I'll oh, noob, 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 you suck, fag. And what I say to that is that, uh... Yeah, I, I get that Moabs probably aren't the hardest thing ever, and that they're really not that hard to get, but I don't know why, but I had so much trouble getting this Moab, guys. It took me forever. I was, I mean, the Moab curse is finally over, guys, and I just want to say that I'm so happy <laughs> that we finally were able to break the curse because I really fought for a long time, and it's kind of the reason I've been playing this game so much in the last, you know, day or two was because I really wanted to make the last push before Call of Duty goes to be able to get this Moab. Um, and I was a little scared there that I actually wasn't going to get the Moab, but um, it finally did happen, guys. I'm super excited. I hope you guys are as well. Uh, of course, you know, I got I was trying as hard as I could. Uh, I got the Butter Camo ACR with the Red Dot Silencer. I uh, got my Specialist Loadout as well. So, uh, I mean, this is a pretty good gameplay. I felt, felt like this was a good Moab. Um, it came down to a really, really clutch ending. I'm not going to spoil exactly how it ends, but it was pretty crazy. It was, you know, pretty last second, and um, I'm, I'm really excited about how this game turned out. It's very unfortunate that I wasn't able to do it on stream, especially since I was actually did, did, uh, did a stream on Twitch last night, and I know it was on Twitch, not YouTube. And the reason for that was um, the only time I ever used my Twitch.tv account, I'll link it down in the description if you want to follow, the only time I ever use my Twitch.tv account is uh, for when I don't really feel like making a big event out of a live stream or if it's really late at night. So last night I turned on my stream about at 1 a.m. just because I want to play if you know Mr. Hunt Noobs. I saw he was playing Mono for 3 so I decided I was going to hop on with him. And uh, so that's the only time I ever turn on my Twitch stream is just when it's really late at night and I don't feel like streaming on YouTube or I don't feel like I'm going to get any viewers on YouTube because it's too late. Stuff like that. So uh so last night actually I actually had a bunch of viewers at, at one point I had upwards of 70 viewers which was kind of crazy I guess there was no one else really streaming um, so a lot of people came to my stream it was a bunch of fun in that clip you saw at the beginning there was one of my worst Moab fails I've ever had um, someone on my stream actually counted I think it was a 21 streak they said uh, shout out to TGK sniper he was kind of being like my streak counter he was posting on chat whatever my streak was so, um, it was really nerve-wracking, um, as MOABs always are, and that's the best thing about MOABs. I really do feel that no matter what Treyarch puts in their game, whether it's nuclears or whatever, there's nothing quite like the rush of being one-off or, you know, being on a MOAB streak. Uh, even people, you know, that have dropped, like, thousands of MOABs, I, I know, I've talked to a few of them personally, and they say, you know, even, even Dazra, and he said, uh, he told me once, you know, he's like, even when you've dropped so many Moabs, you still get that rush in your heart right when you're so close to that Moab and you can just feel it coming. Because it really is a good feeling. And um, what I kind of want to talk about in the later half of this commentary was, you know, I hope there is a Moab coming back in Ghost. And I'll post a picture on the screen right now. Um, this is the supposed Moab coming back in Ghost. I saw this picture from the charlieintel.com. By the way, guys, if you're looking for Call of Duty news, Charlie Intel is a wonderful site. Um, I'll link their site down in the description. You guys have to... You know, bookmark that, uh, favorite it, whatever you got to do. I I check that site almost every day. Uh, that and NintendoLife.com. Those are my two gaming news sites that I always look at, just to make sure that I'm up to date on everything. Uh, you know, there's a bunch of new leaks coming after Call of Duty Ghost, and apparently, because uh, people are, more and more people are starting to get the game, and apparently one of them was uh, this picture. It says 25 or uh, 25 kill streak, and it has a picture of a uh, a little like symbol, and it says K E M strike. Um, I don't know if that's the same strike we f we saw from the reveal event, like the one that everybody was getting out of the care package and was blowing up the map. Um, I, I, I don't think it's the ex I don't think it's the same thing because it seemed rather easy to get in that game type and it would make every map different. So if it is the same thing, I think that's really going to be interesting. But I, you know, I'm so happy that it looks like the Moab is back to me and if uh, the Moab is back, I do think Call of Duty Ghosts will be a good game. And uh, the reason like. I mean, Modern Warfare 3 obviously has a bunch of problems. Look, like there's some map glitching right there. Modern Warfare 3 has a ton of problems, obviously. You know, they've all been stated for the last two years. 
But the greatest thing about Call of Duty and uh, Infinity War Call of Duties is that Moab slash Snoop. And there you go. Get turned on, baby. Moab, 24 point streak. There it is. I'm going to replay that in slow motion. And I uh, hear, you know, here's me calling in the Moab. That is, you know, that's just such a great feeling. I'm so happy that, uh, you know, I finally got that Moab, guys. If you could, let's go for, I'm going to say, 50 likes on this video uh, for the Moab. And I'll see you guys in my next video. Peace.